I'm Taylor Hernandez here at Peggy Adams Animal Rescue League in West Palm Beach. With us here today, we have three-year-old Taco who loves snacks. She's one of the longest residents here at Peggy Adams. Also, Mara Gleason, thanks so much for letting us come out here today. I want to talk with you a little bit about dogs who look a lot like Taco. Bully breeds, as they're called, square-headed dogs. The bigger ones have a harder time getting adopted. Right, we do often see that, especially with all the housing restrictions in our area, we see dogs that are over a certain weight or maybe have a certain appearance of a certain breed, like pit bulls or mixes, bully breeds, we sometimes call them, um, do often have a harder time getting adopted just because of those housing restrictions. And even when they do, sometimes we see them come back because they've been rejected. And talk to me a little bit about some of the misconceptions about these dogs. I mean, Taco was just over here. She's very loving and they're not all aggressive. Right, there's this idea that breed determines personality, which just isn't true at all. It's been proven that the training and the socialization of the dog are really what makes up its personality, and the size and the breed doesn't mean anything as far as aggression. Um, it's really unfortunate that people have that idea. It's just not true. I have two giant dogs at home and they are the most loving dogs in the world. So Mara, thanks so much. If you guys are interested in adopting from Peggy Adams or fostering or volunteering, call the number at the bottom of your screen. We also have this information online. I'm Taylor Hernandez in West Palm Beach. Back to you.